Look over my shoulder and watch as I create a 30 second nature observation for nature's wild things. See my workflow process for transforming raw video footage into something ready for publishing. This raw video is from a photo walk on February 21st, 2017 and it was in one of the parks located in Cabarrus County, North Carolina, and that is in the United States. Okay, we have a beautiful little question mark butterfly here today, and they're one of the uh, brush-footed butterflies. And in case I haven't mentioned this before, it's winter time. It's February in North Carolina but maybe 68 degrees today. A little bit of crispness in the air, but the sun was warm and this beautiful little butterfly was out. And let's take a look at this raw video we took. I was standing on the wrong side of the sun, but that uh, helped show through his wings what maybe was on the inside a little bit. Setting up the camera here and steadying the tripod, getting everything locked down. And just then he decides to turn and give us a look-see and flap his wings a little bit at us. <laughs> and that's about it. He's flapping his wings a little bit. So we can turn this into a nice 30 second video. Let's find the spot when the camera motion stops. And uh, we'll call that the in. And uh, a lot of video of him just holding his wings out. So we'll let him flap a little, call that an out. Let's move that piece of video down to our timeline in Final Cut Pro X on a Mac. And that timeline video is uh, not very long at all. Here it's about 17 seconds long. I'm going to just expand that across the timeline by hitting Shift Z on the keyboard. And now we're left with Now the entire thing is out of, uh, it's just not composed very well. <laughs> I'm one of those guys that likes to, uh, mm, I, I'm one of those guys that likes to uh, have everything proper looking, the same amount of space on either side of the critter in the frame and, and stuff like that. So let's uh, take and turn on our tools here a little bit. Let's go to crop. What we want to do I think is just crop the photo here. Let's see if I can grab a corner and just uh, Now the question I would have is where is he when he moves a little bit? Is that still right in the frame? Oh, I think so. That's going to also zoom in a little bit and let us see him a little better. And just looking at the movement he's making, I just love that little nose up in the air. <laughs> All right, I'm going to leave that there and just bring the end of the video in toward there. So that's giving us about 11 seconds. Let's see at the beginning there. We uh, have two seconds of them. That's about good for being able to uh, 
observe him. Let's take and make that our 30 second video. And we'll change the duration here. And let's just uh, get it in frame here again. That brings us down to about 39% motion speed. I wonder though what uh, whether that'll be enough slow motion here to really observe what he's doing and the way he's doing it, the way he's moving his legs. I think that's pretty good looking. Now we're going to just make sure that the audio track is turned off. Very <laughs> distracting audio here. A lot of uh, man-made sounds and not good nature in this case. Let's throw a dissolve in on this. And uh, I think we have a 30 second nature video.